Good morning everyone. So today I am going to speak on a topic of female reproductive system. Female reproductive system is more complex both structurally and functionally. It consists of a pair of ovaries with the ligaments attached to the uterus. The ovaries produces female gametes or ovas which we usually call eggs. In close relationship with the ovary, we can see that the oviduct is present. It is a funnel shaped structure, usually with a fabricated margin. The egg serves to pick up the ovary liberated from the ova, where the proximal end of the oviduct enters the uterus. Well, what is the uterus in the first place? The uterus is a muscle bag. It consists of three layers of tissues. The external thin layer as the perimetrium, the middle thick layer as the myometrium, and the inner layer as the endometrium. The endometrium lines the uterus cavity, and also the endometrium undergoes several changes during the menstruation cycle. Well, we have talked about endometrium, but the myometrium, on the other hand, exhibits strong contraction during the delivery of the baby. Well, for the delivery of the baby, the ova or the egg should get fertilized in the first place. Well, what is fertilization? The word fertilization meaning the fusion of an egg and a sperm. After fertilization, the egg or the ova develops into embryo. It is a ball of cell. After the process of embryo, the embryo develops into fetus. It is the last stage of development. In this development, we can see the baby's parts clearly and neatly. Well, this process will always not happen. So you may be like, what will happen to the ova released into the ovary? Well, the female reproductive phase of life begins at puberty, 10 to 12 years, and ends at 14 to 50 years. The ovaries produces ovas or ovas uh, every month. The uterus gets thickened as to receive the egg. If, if it gets fertilized, this results in pregnancy. Uh, but if it does not, the uterus thickened line along with its blood vessels are shed off in a form of blood. This causes bleeding in women called as menstruation. The first flow begins at puberty and is termed as menarche. The stoppage of it is called menopause. Well, menstruation may be irregular, but it takes some time to be regular, and these are controlled by the hormones. Thank you, and have a nice day. Well, now I'm going to show you how the menstruation works. So, imagine this is the ova. So, when ova comes from the oviduct to the uterus, if it gets fertilized, this results in pregnancy. But if it does not, the ovaries, the ova come into the uterus. But this does not result in pregnancy. In, in fact, this results in menstruation. This, there will be blood coming. Thank you and have a nice day.